secondary lymphoid organs in contrast to the primary lymphoid organs these are called as secondary lymphoid organs jaise humne baat ki ke primary lymphoid organs they are central lymphoid organs means unhone centrally jo lymphocytes hain wo provide karne hain on the other hand secondary lymphoid organs these are peripheral lymphoid organs means ye distant hain regarding to primary lymphoid organs or they are being controlling by the central lymphoid organs so what would be the important function which would be uh, performed by the secondary lymphoid organs it involves providing adaptive immune response means whenever there would be certain kind of infectious agent enter inside our body so inside the secondary lymphoid organs the lymphocyte they will move and ultimately it will try to fight against that particular invading or infectious agent how it happens basically the secondary lymphoid organs or primary lymphoid organs these are the sites ye aisi jagahein hain jahan pe interaction hona hai interaction किस चीज का होना है इंटरेक्शन होना है एंटीजन का एंटीजन जो कि एक फॉरेन पार्टिकल है इन्फेक्शियस एजेंट हो सकता है इनवेडिंग एजेंट लाइक बैक्टीरिया वायरस इट कैन बी सो एट डेट साइट ऑफ सेकेंडरी लिम्फॉइड टिश्यू और पेरिफ्रल लिम्फॉइड ऑर्गन देयर वुड बी द इंटरेक्शन बिटवीन एंटीजन एंड इट्स कोरेस्पॉन्डिंग लिम्फोसाइट जब लिम्फोसाइट्स ने उन एंटीबॉडी को किल उन एंटीजन को किल करने के लिए वेन एवर दे आर गोइंग टू बी देयर सो दिस काइंड ऑफ प्रोसेस हैव टू बी हैपन इन साइड सेकेंडरी और पेरिफ्रल लिम्फॉइड ऑर्गन बट जो सेल्स आ रहे हैं जो लिम्फोसाइट्स आ रहे हैं वो कहां से आ रहे हैं वो प्राइमरी लिम्फॉइड टिश्यू से या जनरेटिव लिम्फॉइड टिश्यू से आ रहे हैं ओके सो वेयर these secondary lymphoid organ are located so according to various anatomical locations or anatomical sites for example inside our body there are so many tissues are being there so according to different tissues they are being residing kyun kyunki inki importance ye hai ki ye body ke har organ mein present hone chahiye kyunki agar koi infectious agent ya bacteria virus us organ mein enter hoga तो ये सेकेंडरी लिम्फॉइड ऑर्गन दे आर गोइंग टू बी रेडी फॉर फाइटिंग अगेंस्ट दैट पर्टिकुलर इनवेडिंग और इन्फेक्शियस एजेंट और उसके लिए जरूरी है कि उसमें लिम्फोसाइट्स हो और वो लिम्फोसाइट्स प्राइमरी लिम्फॉइड टिश्यू से आएंगे बट द इंटरेक्शन कहाँ होगा सेकेंडरी लिम्फॉइड टिश्यू या सेकेंडरी लिम्फॉइड ऑर्गन एंड हेयर वी कैन सी डेट देयर आर सो मेनी एग्जाम्पल्स ऑफ secondary lymphoid organs like jaise according to anatomical sites you know that the lymph nodes nodes are there are certain kinds of you can say that p like structure matter ke size ka kuch structure hamari body mein they are being present particularly you can observe underneath our armpits hamare armpits ke under whenever you can feel there are inside certain p like tissue is being present those are particularly called as lymphoid organs they are also present in different sites we will see later similarly spleen is an other important secondary lymphoid tissue that is present beneath or underneath the liver tonsils it is also very important kind of the secondary lymphoid tissue you can see that inside our throat they are being present because they have to be fight against all those invading agents जो के हमारे मुंह के रास्ते से ओरली दे आर ट्राइंग टू एंटर इन साइड ओवर बॉडी डेट्स वाई द नेचर हैज प्रोवाइडेड अकॉर्डिंग टू देयर साइट बिकॉज दिस साइट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सिमिलरली एडिनॉइड एडिनॉइड दे आर ऑल्सो बींग प्रेजेंट दे आर अंडरनीथ ऑफ ओवर इयर्स यू कैन से डेट देर आर सर्टन लिम्फॉइड ऑर्गन आर प्रेजेंट विच आर कॉल्ड एज एडिनॉइड और इन्हीं एडिनॉइड्स की जब इन्फेक्शन या इन्फ्लामेशन होती है तो उसे मम्प्स कहते हैं आम फहम जुबान में उसे कान पेड़े भी कहते हैं एनदर एग्जाम्पल इज अपेंडिक्स ऑल ऑफ यू नो 
I'm very familiar that means that the appendix that is the tissue which is being residing inside our gastrointestinal tract particularly large intestine and pyre patches it is also very important kind of secondary lymphoid organ which is present inside the gastrointestinal tract so here is the diagrammatically representation of all these secondary and primary lymphoid organs according to their anatomical location for example you can see that thymus is the primary lymphoid organ it is present underneath our heart or you can say that in thoracic cavity similarly bone marrow is present in all kind of bones particularly major bones here you can see that humerus is being there and the bone marrow of the humerus is a primary lymphoid organ similarly secondary lymphoid organ according to their location you can see adenoids they are present here underneath of our ears you can say that and tonsils they are present inside our throat lymph nodes they are present you can see that here underneath our armpits spleen it is very close or underneath of the liver this lobe of the liver and similarly pyre patches they are present inside the small intestine and the large intestine appendix is present inside the large intestine here and the lymph node they are also being present inside groin area means our thighs the region between our thighs and our abdominal cavity is called as groin area ye groin area these are also very rich in lymphoid organ so from here you can learn that according to different or various anatomical location these secondary as well as primary lymphoid organ residing so particularly the main function of these lymphoid organs or lymphoid tissue is to provide defense against invading or infectious agents